Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A woman is speaking on the phone at a train station. B. A teacher is giving a lecture in a classroom. C. A group of people is entering a cafe. D. Passengers are boarding a flight. The correct answer is A. A woman is speaking on the phone at a train station. Number 2. A. A group of students is attending a lecture. B. People are boarding a bus at the bus stop. C. A family is shopping for groceries. D. A woman is walking her dog in the park. The correct answer is A. A group of students is attending a lecture. Number 3. A. People are shopping at a grocery store. B. A chef is preparing food in a kitchen. C. A man is talking on the phone while drinking coffee. D. A group of tourists is taking pictures in a park. The correct answer is C. A man is talking on the phone while drinking coffee. Number 4. A. People are attending a wedding ceremony. B. A woman is typing on a laptop in a bank. C. A man is painting a house. D. A group of students is studying. The correct answer is B. A woman is typing on a laptop in a bank. Number 5. A. People are boarding a train at a station. B. A person is giving a presentation in a park. C. A group of people is attending a meeting indoors. D. Business people are discussing data near a train station. The correct answer is D. Business people are discussing data near a train station. Number 6. A. A group of people is jogging in a park. B. People are enjoying a meal in a park. C. Two people are walking along a beach. D. A woman is serving food at a cafe. The correct answer is B. People are enjoying a meal in a park. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. What time is the CEO's speech? I so so on CEO's speech. A. He is from Japan. B. At 3 p.m. C. No, I missed it. The correct answer is B. At 3 p.m. Number 2. Which train should I take to get to the city center? A. It departs every hour. B. The express train. C. Tickets are at the counter. The correct answer is B. The express train. Number 3. What time does the meeting start? A. No, I haven't received the agenda yet. B. I think it's scheduled for next week. C. At 3 p.m. in the main conference room. The correct answer is C. At 3 p.m. in the main conference room. Number 4. Did you receive my email? A. I'm not sure about the date. B. I will check my schedule. C. Yes, I got it this morning. The correct answer is C. Yes, I got it this morning. Number 5. Have you seen the new marketing plan? A. I haven't had lunch yet. B. Yes, it's on my desk. C. We are meeting on Friday. The correct answer is B. 
Yes, it's on my desk. Number 6. What type of documents are required? A. A valid ID and application form. B. Submitted by email. C. Follow the instructions. The correct answer is A. A valid ID and application form. Number 7. Who's in charge of the new project? A. The meeting is in room 12. B. Mrs. Brown is leading it. C. I just finished a project. The correct answer is B. Mrs. Brown is leading it. Number 8. Are you free for lunch today? A. Yes, I am available at noon. B. I prefer Italian food. C. Let's have a meeting instead. The correct answer is A. Yes, I am available at noon. Number 9. Do you know where Sarah is? A. She's in a meeting. B. On the desk. C. Yes, I did. The correct answer is A. She's in a meeting. Number 10. Why is the office closed early today? A. There is a company event. B. We'll open again tomorrow. C. I came in late. The correct answer is A. There is a company event. Number 11. Do you think it will rain today? A. I don't have my umbrella. B. Yes, I brought my raincoat. C. No, it's sunny right now. The correct answer is C. No, it's sunny right now. Number 12. Can you join us for dinner tonight? A. I had lunch already. B. Dinner is my favorite meal. C. I'd love to, but I have other plans. The correct answer is C. I'd love to, but I have other plans. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. We need to schedule the quarterly performance review meetings. How about next Tuesday? That works for me. I'll send out the invites. Thanks. I'll prepare the agenda. When will the performance review meetings be scheduled? A. Next Monday. B. Next Tuesday. C. Next Wednesday. The correct answer is B. Next Tuesday. Number 2. Can you send me the latest sales report by tonight? Sure, I'm almost done with it. Great. I'll need it for the meeting tomorrow morning. I'll email it to you as soon as it's finished. When does the woman need the sales report? A. Next week. B. For tomorrow morning's meeting. C. By tonight. The correct answer is B. For tomorrow morning's meeting. Number 3. Can you attend the client meeting in Chicago next week? I'm not sure. What day is it? It's scheduled for Thursday morning. I can make it then. I'll book my flight today. What day is the client meeting? A. Wednesday. B. Tuesday. C. Thursday. The correct answer is C. Thursday. Number 4. I have to leave early today. Can you finish the presentation slides? No problem. I'll take care of it. Thank you. I'll review them first thing tomorrow. Sounds good. What task does the man need to do? A. Review the slides. B. Finish the presentation slides. C. Leave early. The correct answer is B. Finish the presentation slides. Number 5. I've booked the meeting room for our presentation on Thursday. Excellent. Do we have all the materials prepared? Yes. 
Everything is ready. Perfect. Let's review them one last time tomorrow. Agreed. When is the presentation scheduled? A. Thursday. B. Wednesday. C. Monday. The correct answer is A. Thursday. Number 6. Who is presenting the sales report tomorrow? I believe John is handling it. Good to know. I'll prepare the slides for him. Thanks. He appreciates your help. Who is preparing the slides for the sales report presentation? A. John. B. Woman. C. Another colleague. The correct answer is B. Woman. Number 7. Do you have the contract ready? Yes, but I'm waiting for the final approval. When do you expect to get it? By the end of the day. When is the final approval expected? A. By the end of the day. B. Tomorrow. C. In the morning. The correct answer is A. By the end of the day. Number 8. Are you coming to the team lunch tomorrow? Yes, I've already made a reservation for 12.30 p.m. Great, I'll see you there. Looking forward to it. What time is the team lunch? A. 12 p.m. B. 1 p.m. C. 12.30 p.m. The correct answer is C. 12.30 p.m. Number 9. The printer in the copy room is jammed again. I'll call the technician to fix it. Thanks. Meanwhile, I'll use the one on the second floor. Good idea. Where will the man go to print documents? A. Third floor. B. First floor. C. Second floor. The correct answer is... C. Second floor. Number 10. The IT department is upgrading the software tonight. Will it affect our work tomorrow? There might be some downtime in the morning. Hopefully it won't last too long. When is the software upgrade happening? A. This afternoon. B. Tonight. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is... B. Tonight. Number 11. Can you attend the client meeting at 10 a.m. tomorrow? I have another meeting at that time. Okay, I'll reschedule it for 11 a.m. That works for me? Thanks. What time was the client meeting originally scheduled? A. At 10 a.m. B. At 9 a.m. C. At 11 a.m. The correct answer is... A. At 10 a.m. Number 12. Do you have the minutes from last week's team meeting? Yes, I'll email them to you now. Thanks. I need to review them before our next meeting. What does the woman need the meeting minutes for? A. To review before the next meeting. B. To write a report. C. To send to the team. The correct answer is... A. To review before the next meeting. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Thanks for joining our neighborhood cleanup event. Today we're focusing on picking up litter and planting trees. Please meet at the main park entrance at 9 a.m. Gloves and bags will be provided. What is the focus of today's event? A. Picking up litter and planting trees. B. Planting flowers. C. Renovating playgrounds. The correct answer is A. Picking up litter and planting trees. Number two. Thank you for joining today's business seminar. We will cover efficient project management techniques. Remember to take notes and network during the breaks. The event will conclude with a Q&A session. What should participants do during the breaks? A. Network with others. B. Prepare for Q&A. C. Leave the venue.
The correct answer is C. Network with others. Number 3. Welcome to today's seminar on digital marketing. We'll explore strategies to enhance your online presence. Our first session will cover social media tips. Don't miss the Q&A at the end. When is the Q&A session? A. At the end. B. In the middle. C. At the beginning. The correct answer is B. At the end. Number 4. Good afternoon, everyone. Today, I'll be discussing the importance of cybersecurity in our daily lives. With the increasing number of online threats, it's crucial to stay informed and protected. Always remember to use strong passwords and enable two-factor authentication. What is crucial in staying protected online? A. Avoiding online shopping. B. Using strong passwords. C. Keeping your computer turned off. The correct answer is A. Using strong passwords. Number 5. Welcome to the Tech Conference. Today's keynote speech will address the latest advancements in artificial intelligence. Be sure to visit the exhibition hall where various companies are showcasing new tech products. What will today's keynote speech address? A. Latest advancements in artificial intelligence. B. Cybersecurity threats. C. New software development techniques. The correct answer is A. Latest advancements in artificial intelligence. Number 6. Good afternoon. Today's first lecture will cover the basics of financial management. This includes budgeting, saving, and investing effectively. Make sure to take notes as the material will be included in next week's test. If you have any questions, feel free to ask at the end of the session. What will today's first lecture cover? A. The basics of financial management. B. Business communication skills. C. Introduction to psychology. The correct answer is A. The basics of financial management. Number 7. Our new mobile app is now available for download. It helps you track your fitness progress and offers personalized workout plans. Get started by creating a profile and setting your goals. Enjoy a healthier lifestyle with our app. What does the app help you do? A. Book travel tickets. B. Shop for groceries. C. Track fitness progress. The correct answer is C. Track fitness progress. Number 8. Attention residents. There will be a water supply interruption tomorrow from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. due to maintenance work. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. Please store enough water for your needs. Why will there be a water supply interruption? A. To save water. B. Due to maintenance work. C. To clean the tanks. The correct answer is B. Due to maintenance work. Number 9. Attention all passengers. Due to weather conditions, several flights have been delayed. Please check the departure boards for the latest information. We apologize for any inconvenience caused and thank you for your understanding. Why were several flights delayed? A. Weather conditions. B. Technical issues. C. Crew shortages. The correct answer is C. Weather conditions. Number 10. This is your captain speaking. We'll be cruising at an altitude of 35,000 feet. The weather on our route is smooth and we expect an on-time arrival. Please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened and enjoy the flight. What altitude will the plane cruise at? A. 40,000 feet. B. 30,000 feet. C. 35,000 feet. The correct answer is B. 35,000 feet. Number 11. Join us for an informative workshop on financial planning this Thursday evening. Our expert speaker will cover topics such as budgeting, 
investments, and retirement planning. The workshop will be held in the community center from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Attendees will have the opportunity to ask questions and receive personalized advice. What topics will the workshop cover? A. Cooking. B. Gardening. C. Financial planning. The correct answer is B. Financial planning. Number 12. Hello, everyone. Due to the upcoming holidays, our office will be closed from December 24th to January 2nd. Please make sure to complete any urgent tasks before the break. We wish you a happy holiday season. Baha Kubaka. When will the office be closed? A. December 23rd to January 1st. B. December 24th to January 2nd. C. December 24th to December 31st. The correct answer is B. December 24th to January 2nd. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin! Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, the contract. Signed by the end of the week. A, has been. B, will have been. C, was. D, will be. The correct answer is. B, will have been. Number two. She insisted. Attending the meeting despite her busy schedule. A. To. B. About. C. On. D. In. The correct answer is. C. On. Number three. The CEO expects the results. By next week. A. Delivered. B. Deliver. C. Being delivered. D. To be delivered. The correct answer is D. To be delivered. Number four. I'll meet you. The front of the building. A. In. B. At. C. On. D. By. The correct answer is B. At. Number 5. The report. To be submitted by Friday. A. Needs. B. Will. C. Has. D. Is. The correct answer is A. Needs. Number 6. The presentation was interesting than I expected. A. More. B. So. C. Most. D. Very. The correct answer is A. More. Number seven. He avoided the question during the meeting. A. Answer. B. Answering. C. Answers. D. To answer. The correct answer is B. Answering. Number 8. His busy schedule, he found time to attend the meeting. A. In spite of. B. Because of. C. Despite. D. Although. The correct answer is. C. Despite. Number 9. She regrets. Not enough time for the project. A. Spend. B. Spent. C. To spend. D. Spending. The correct answer is D. Spending. Number 10. He has worked here. Five years. A. For. B. Since. C. During. D. In. The 
The correct answer is A. 4. Number 11. The employee has worked here. 20 to 10. A. From. B. In. C. Since. D. 4. The correct answer is C. Since. Number 12. They. To finish the report by the end of the day. A. Hoped. B. Hope. C. Hoping. D. Hopes. The correct answer is B. Hope. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Dear customer, your subscription is set to On April 1st, please renew your subscription to continue enjoying our services. A. Expiring. B. Expired. C. Expiration. D. Expire. The correct answer is D. Expire. Number 2. Memo. All employees are requested to attend the training session scheduled. Monday. Thank you, admin team. A. 4. B. In. C. 2. D. On. The correct answer is D. On. Number 3. Dear colleagues, please be aware that the company's annual meeting has been 2. Next Wednesday. Your attendance is highly appreciated. Thank you. Ninasani? Administration. A. Postpone. B. Postponed. C. Postponement. D. Postponing. The correct answer is B. Postponed. Number 4. We are pleased to inform you that our company will be a new office in downtown soon. A. Open. B. Opening. C. Opened. D. Opens. The correct answer is B. Opening. Number 5. Dear Ms. Clark, we are delighted to announce that you have been for the Employee of the Month Award. Congratulations, best, the management team. A. Nominated. B. Nominate. C. Nominating. D. Nominates. The correct answer is A. Nominated. Number 6. Reminder. The office will be Nice for the public holiday on Monday. Please plan accordingly. Regards. Administration. A. Closure. B. Closed. C. Close. D. Closing. The correct answer is B. Closed. And finally, Part 7. Reading. Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. We are thrilled to inform you that our online store is now live. You can now purchase our products directly from our website. Enjoy exclusive online offers and discounts. Happy shopping! What is the new feature mentioned in the text? A. A new physical store opening. B. An online store is now live. C. A new product launch. The correct answer is B. An online store is now live. Number 2. Attention all tenants. The building will undergo a fire safety inspection on Monday, August 24th between 9 o'clock a.m. and 12 o'clock p.m. During this time, alarms may be tested and brief interruptions to building access might occur. We appreciate your patience and cooperation. Best, building management. What will happen on August 24th? A. A pest control visit. B. An air quality survey. C. A fire safety inspection. The correct answer is C. 
A fire safety inspection. Number three, join us for our next webinar on effective project management strategies. Learn tips and techniques from industry experts that you can apply to achieve better project outcomes. Register online to secure your spot. What is the main idea of this announcement? A. Promotion of a project management webinar. B. Results of a recent survey. C. Introduction to new software tools. The correct answer is A. Promotion of a project management webinar. Number 4. Ladies and gentlemen, due to maintenance work on our servers, our online services will not be available on Saturday, March 10th from 2 a.m. to 6 a.m. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and appreciate your understanding. Best regards. Technical support. What is the notice regarding? A. Upgrade to faster servers. B. Launch of new features. C. Scheduled maintenance work. The correct answer is C. Scheduled maintenance work. Number 5. We are thrilled to announce the launch of our new mobile app designed to streamline our services and improve user experience. The app is available for download on both iOS and Android platforms. Get it now and enjoy exclusive features. What is the main announcement? A. Expansion to new locations. B. A company rebranding. C. The launch of a new mobile app. The correct answer is C. New customer support hours. Number 6. Please be informed that the annual maintenance of our IT systems will take place this Friday from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. During this period, access to company databases will be restricted. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. When will the IT systems maintenance happen? A. This Friday from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. B. This Wednesday afternoon. C. Next Monday morning. The correct answer is A. This Friday from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. Number 7. Dear clients, we are offering a limited time promotion on our monthly subscriptions. Sign up before October 31st to enjoy a 15% discount for the first six months. Don't miss out. Visit our website for more details. Best Customer Service Team. What is being offered in this announcement? A. A new service launch. B. A limited time promotion on subscriptions. C. A customer survey. The correct answer is B. A limited time promotion on subscriptions. Number 8. Attention. Due to maintenance work, the office elevators will be out of service from 8 p.m. to 6 a.m. for the next two days. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. Facility Management Why will the office elevators be out of service? A. For a thorough cleaning. B. Because of an inspection. C. Due to maintenance work. The correct answer is C. Due to maintenance work. Number 9. Hello everyone, we are pleased to announce that our new website will launch on July 1st with added features and an improved user experience. Don't forget to visit and explore the new site. Best, Web Development Team. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To announce a service disruption. B. To announce a price increase. C. To announce a new website launch. The correct answer is C. To announce a new website launch. Number 10. We are excited to notify you about our new online training platform launching next month. This platform will offer a wide range of courses to enhance your skills and knowledge. Stay tuned for more details and how to get started. What is the new initiative being mentioned? A. An online training platform. B. A product discount. C. A new office opening. The correct answer is A. An online training platform. 
Number 11. We are pleased to inform you that the company will be holding its annual general meeting on October 20th at the Hyatt Regency Hotel. All shareholders are encouraged to attend. Topics of discussion will include company performance, future strategies, and the election of board members. Your participation is highly valued. What is the purpose of this notice? A. To inform about a company event. B. To announce the annual general meeting. C. To discuss financial performance. The correct answer is B. To announce the annual general meeting. Number 12. To all staff, we are pleased to inform you that the company has finalized the acquisition of TechCorp Inc. This strategic move will enhance our product offerings and market reach. We will be holding a town hall meeting next Monday to discuss future plans. Regards, Management Team. What is being announced? A. An employee promotion. B. The acquisition of TechCorp Inc. C. A new product launch. The correct answer is B. The acquisition of TechCorp Inc. Number 13. Starting next Monday, the office will have new operating hours. Monday to Friday from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. This change aims to provide better service to our clients. What is changing about the office's operating hours? A. They will start at 8 a.m. and end at 6 p.m. B. They will start at 9 a.m. and end at 5 p.m. C. They will remain the same. The correct answer is A. They will start at 8 a.m. and end at 6 p.m. Number 14. The Green Trail Marathon will be held on July 12th. Participants should register online by July 5th to secure their spots. The event will start at 7 a.m. from Pine Park and cover a distance of 21 kilometers. When is the deadline to register for the Green Trail Marathon? A. July 5th. B. July 10th. C. July 1st. The correct answer is A. July 7th. Number 15. Dear members, we are thrilled to announce the opening of our new fitness center on January 5th. The facility includes a variety of state-of-the-art equipment, group classes, and personal training options. Come and join us to start your fitness journey. Sincerely, Gym Management. What is the main announcement in this message? A. A discount on memberships. B. A special event for members. C. The opening of a new fitness center. The correct answer is C. The opening of a new fitness center. Number 16. Dear clients, our office will be closed on Monday, November 22nd in observance of the national holiday. We will resume regular business hours on Tuesday, November 23rd. Have a great holiday. Best regards, client services. Why will the office be closed on November 22nd? A. Due to a staff meeting. B. In observance of the national holiday. C. For office renovations. The correct answer is B. In observance of the national holiday. Number 17. Dear valued customers, we are thrilled to announce the launch of our new product line next month. These innovations will bring you the latest in technology and design. Stay tuned for more details on our official website. What is the announcement about? A. Discontinuing an old product line. B. Offering a discount on existing products. C. Launching a new product line. The correct answer is C. Launching a new product line. Number 18. Dear patrons, we regret to inform you that our restaurant will be closed for renovation from July 10th to July 20th. We look forward to welcoming you back with an updated menu and a refreshed dining area. Thank you for your patronage. Best regards, the management. What is the main idea of this notice? A. New menu introduction. B. Temporary restaurant closure for renovation. C. Special dining offers.
The correct answer is B. Temporary restaurant closure for renovation.